Hey everyone, I've been wanting to film this video for such a long time, but of course life always gets in the way. Uh, if you can see, I am in a new place than the last video because I moved again. It was not really planned this time, um, but I am in the process of moving in. Everything is a little messy, but I wanted to show you guys some of my Halloween haul because if you know me, you know I've been celebrating Halloween since about October 17th when Disney World started celebrating Halloween. So I have so much cool stuff and decorations this year that I want to show you guys and it'll kind of also be a little new place tour, I guess. So let's get started. This is like my main little Halloween table in my room. I got a lot of this stuff from Dollar Tree, so it was really cheap. I don't actually know what I'm gonna do with a lot of this. I might put this, I have a purple one too, down the staircase. And I have these really cool little bat lights, uh, just some purple lights, and then this little lantern that also lights up. Uh, these I got at Joann's because they had their stuff out like right at the beginning of August, which was beautiful. I got this little guy too there. And then this is obviously from Mickey's Not So Scary this year. It says, Happy Halloween on the back and it lights up on top. Um, I get the popcorn buckets every year from Halloween. So of course I had to get this one as well. And it looks pretty cool when it's lit up uh, when it's a little bit darker out. No decorations are going to be complete without my window clings that I get every year. I still have my penguin from Christmas up on my bathroom mirror, but I have these ones to put up now. These are from, from I believe, they're from Target. Um, wait, no, these are from Joann's. I'm sorry. These were $3.99. Um, you can buy them at Target as well. And moving on to my little table in my hallway area, we have some more stuff from Dollar Tree and Target. This tree was bought in the dollar section at Target for $5. And then these are actually two different packs of Halloween bulbs from Dollar Tree. I already dropped one all the way down to the first floor and broke one. So we're missing one, but that's fine. I have extras. I have this little screamy cat. He is also from the dollar section at Target. I believe he was $3. And then this is my Mickey light up Halloween trick or treat bucket from this year. Um, Walt Disney World offers them to be personalized now, like kind of the same way they'll personalize a Christmas ornament. So I got mine all, all personalized out this year and I love it. The artist did such a good job. So if any of you are going to Disney World around Halloween, this is a super cool souvenir. Speaking of Disney World and Halloween, this is this little stand I have in my little hallway area with Oogie Boogie from last year's Halloween party. He's just always out. He's not really special for Halloween. And now we are here in my closet because of course, no Halloween haul is gonna be complete without some really cute Halloween outfits. Uh, the first one I have is the Hocus Pocus Spirit Jersey. This is available at the Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Parties in Magic Kingdom. It is celebrating the 25th anniversary of Hocus Pocus as well as the Villain Spelltacular show is the one they do on the castle stage at all the Halloween parties. Um, and then this is the back, which is just super cute. Little binks on there. Anyways, he, that one is super adorable. Uh, that was the regular price of Spirit Jerseys at Disney, so about $59.99 plus tax. We also have uh, the women's cut of the Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party shirt this year. Uh, the little pie and Mickey and Minnie are the characters for this year and I think they're just so cute. I love them so much. And then this is the back. And then some more deals from Target. I got this really cute little raglan shirt that says Resting Witch Face. It's really comfy and cute and if it's Halloween-ish I have to buy it of course. Um, I Luckily, because I go to the parks and stuff a lot, I have a lot of excuses to wear Halloween stuff. And then we finally have Marshalls, which is another great place to buy any holiday stuff. I always find really good deals there. Um, I got a 10-pack of Halloween socks that I will literally wear all year round for $5.99. I got a pumpkin spice candle because I can never have enough pumpkin spice in my life for only $3.99. And then my favorite purchase was this Halloween cat mug because I absolutely love mugs 
and this was only $2.99. I also got some more Disney merchandise that I didn't show in the video because it is either still in bags or it is in the kitchen because it is the Hocus Pocus Cauldron mug from the stage show, which is really cute. I have the new Mickey ghost mug. It's like the Mickey Jack Lantern mug last year with the ears, but it's a ghost and it says boo to you on the back and it's super cute. And then I also got the mini spinner pin from the party. And that is about it for my little Halloween haul slash new place tour. Um, I wanted to make a lot more Halloween stuff for this video and do like a real, um, like actual haul where I sit down and show you all this stuff. But like I said, life gets in the way. Um, I had to move and so I, instead of packing all this stuff up and just keeping it packed up in boxes while I get everything sorted out, I just wanted to get it all out and get it set up for Halloween. So that's why it's already set up and out. Uh, but thank you guys for watching this video. Let me know what your favorite things to buy around Halloween are. And I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching and make sure to subscribe. Bye.